Hi, I'm Carrie Bick with HowToHomeschoolMyChild.com and I'm happy to be with you today to share with you another one of our Excellence in Writing resources. This particular resource is more for older students. It's called Classical Rhetoric Through Structure and Style. And basically what it's going to do is use our nine units in our teaching, writing, structure, and style and teach your students classical rhetoric. So let's back up a minute, all right? For those of you that don't know me, I was a homeschool mom for 10 years. My first year, I bought a writing program. Now, I didn't buy it in August. I bought it in January. Because, see, in August, I went to all these book fairs, and everything looked just like what I had used when I was teaching school and when I was teaching writing to fifth graders. I didn't thought, I can do this on my own. That is until I found Andrew Pudua in the Institute for Excellence in Writing and the Teaching, Writing, Structure, and Style resource. I used it all 10 years. Now, at the beginning, that's all there was. Now, we have theme-based writing, and they're all based on the nine units taught in teaching, writing, structure, and style. And that's exactly what classical rhetoric does, is it's going to teach classical rhetoric through units one, two, three, and on through unit nine. If you're not familiar with teaching, writing, and structure, and style, I'd encourage you to go take a look at that product and see if you understand it well enough. Um, they're not going to be teaching you what's in that particular resource for teachers. They're going to assume you have knowledge of teaching, writing, structure, and style as they go through the lessons. But if you do, this is a breeze. Let me just tell you a little bit about this. For those of you that aren't sure what classical rhetoric is, and I'm going to use a really big word because this particular resource teaches through the progenesma. Let me just see where that is. Um, that is just basically the old way of teaching rhetoric, teaching persuasion, uh, especially in the written format. Rhetoric is both verbal and it's written. And your kids are going to need to learn the art of persuasion at some time or another, so why not teach them how to do it right? In the beginning, we have an introduction to the student and to the teacher. It's going to explain how this works and what a check sheet is. Let's just start with Unit 1. Here's Unit 1. They're all set up similarly. There is going to be your objectives for that lesson, your source text. That's what you're going to use to base your writing on, and all the lessons have a source text that's included in this manual. You don't have to go looking somewhere else for them. There's going to be an explanation of what this lesson's about, and then the assignment, one, two, three, and four. Read this, reread the passage, circle the words, follow the models provided. Then we turn the page, and we learn about our structure tools, our note outline model, and then we have rhetoric fun. All the lessons are concluded by some sort of fun and rhetoric. Let's move on into maybe a little more difficult uh, lesson. This is Unit 3, Narratio. What do you think that is? Narrating, storytelling. This is Lesson 6. We have our objective. It's Thomas Carlyle. Here's your source text about Thomas Carlyle. You're going to read that uh, excerpt of the French Revolution. Then we have our assignment, 1 and 2, and then we go right into structural tools. That's your outlines, your models, the writing model that your kids are going to follow to be successful. And then basically, story sequence chart, helpful questions. Here is a sample story outline. Then we're going to move into style. What's going to improve your writing? One is uh, structure, using a good outline to get started. But what will make it even better is to keep learning stylistic techniques. This particular lesson is style and tool examples, strong verbs. So they're going to go through that and do some review as well. And then that's your lesson. That's your entire lesson. Continues all the way through the book. In the very back, you will see that we have the answers to any questions or exercises. And in the front is a bonus. If you um, get this, you will also be given the student resource notebook in ebook format. And this blue page in our Excellence in Writing program always refers to where you can go online to download that particular bonus item. Um, I think rhetoric is very important, and I think too often we sort of forget to teach that. We get so wrapped up in all the traditional school subjects, and yet classical rhetoric, I think, is very important. If you're following the classical model or the Charlotte Mason model, 
this is something I would highly recommend. But I personally think all high school kids should go through one class of rhetoric. And this would be a great one. It's 30 lessons a whole year long. So it's really easy to follow. You don't, it can save you a lot of time as a mom or as a teacher. It's all set out for you. You just go through the lessons with your kids. If you want to grab a copy, use the website on this video. Give me a call if you have a question. I'll be happy to discuss any concerns you have. And if this isn't the right resource, let's talk about what you need and what your kids need to be successful in their homeschool or in their classroom. I'm Carrie Beck with HowToHomeschoolMyChild.com. Hope you're having a great day. Thanks so much.